Big win tonight for us at, at the Bernabeu. What do you guys think of the match? Uh, the match was very close, actually. Malmö played very well. Uh, yeah, it is very well. Uh, they almost tied a very important record, that of Besiktas, losing 8-0 against Liverpool uh, a few years ago. No, no, it was a very good game. It was a close match, like you said. What do you think of the match? Yeah, we are really pleased with the results. I guess Real Madrid beat the record of the home win, eight, eight, eight uh, goals for Real Madrid. That's why we are really, really pleased and it's a big day for all the fans from Real Madrid. It is a good day for the fans of Real Madrid. Did you think we were going to score that many goals coming into this match? Uh, honestly, I didn't think so. I thought it was going to be a very close game. Close? Wait, you thought it was really going to be close? Yes, yes. Uh, because Bale was not playing, Navas was not playing, so I thought that Malmö would score more goals. It was uh, insane. No, no, it was, uh, I didn't Malmö expect. wasn't even close to scoring any goals. Uh, what did you think coming into this match? Yeah, to be honest, that uh, all of us know that the team is recovering from the bad moments after El Clasico, but I guess it's a good prognostic and for the future and it will be much better. I agree, I think that's that's a good point. We're on our way, we've won a couple of games now coming off that, that horrible loss here against Barcelona. This is a good thing for us. Do you think for the future? What do you think? Um, to be honest, uh, Malmö is not... Yes, I'm going to be honest. I have to. Uh, we're on TV, you know. Um, so, Malmö was not a very good team, so I don't think that uh, it shows uh, right now how the quality of Real Madrid. So, I don't think it's a game to look at to. I mean, it's good for the future, but there's still a long way to go. Benitez, uh, sorry, yeah. Benitez's future is very uncertain to the club, for sure. I think that's a very, very fair point. And when they said at the very beginning of the match, when they called Rafa Benitez as the coach, everyone was booing him. Yes, yes. Uh, Were this you booing him? Uh, to be honest, a little bit yes, a little bit yes, because I really don't like him. No. Uh, but uh, I think that it's a good thing that they booed him to put some stress on him because uh, he was very loose in the beginning of the season and uh, the team was not playing very well. Good. So you think going on in the future, you think Benitez will do a better job? Do you think Real Madrid will, will continue to get better? Yes or no? I guess when the uh, board of directors decided to hire the new coach, uh, now they should, him, should, should give him more time to, to, to do his best and uh, we should, we should uh, wait for the results and I hope that they will come. They will come for sure, so be patient and I hope it will be alright. Awesome, I like that positivity, guys. Give us a a la Madrid and say goodbye to the camera. One, a la... Two, a la... One, two, three. Uno, dos, tres. A la Madrid! A la Madrid! A la Madrid.